ready. One day, Thomas was going outside in the morning. He went up a big mountain. He never went before. I mean, so top of the hat saw Percy flying in the air. Then James woke up when he heard the noise. Maybe it's time to woke up, he said. I mean, wake up. So he went on the turntable. It's ten. Could have fit when he's tender. So. He went the same way that Thomas went. Then he was going in the tunnel. Bold and 
coming down. He saw something blue like Thomas, but it was just warning. He was gonna get some freak cars on the end of the line. In the middle of the bridge, there were some freak cars. Saw the freak cars, saw Thomas picking up the passengers. He had a hurry. He quickly hurried in the tunnel. And the freight cars looked down at James. What's that red big five monster looking at us? It's like a big kindergartner. You say kindergartner? The other freight car said. The truck laughed and laughed. Ah! Even last even more. Then he saw the train. It's moving up. Until he was gonna bump into Thomas. And BOOM! My tender! The car's laughing laugh. Still, Sir Thomas had head stars on. He said, Oh, where am I? He told himself. to James. I hope you should be careful with freight cars. I mean, more careful with freight cars. Next time, you should be more careful. Okay? Okay. Spanish and red. James, the car said. They laughed even more. People didn't know what the freight cars were, and one just moved and sticked out his head. When Nanny and Clarabelle were getting the fix from the crash, Thomas decided to feel a little better about that today. 